Hey loves! Good morning! Happy Sunday! So today is Sunday and <laughs> I don't know why I'm so happy this Sunday but it is what it is. So I'm about going to church. I'm in front of my neighbor's house. Ooh. I'm in front of my neighbor's house waiting for her to come. Let's go with her kids. I don't know why she's taking so long. Like, <laughs> fam, this dress of mine today, ah, I don't know. <laughs> It is when you say tight. I don't know if it's I've gotten fat or is that the dress has gotten small. I really do not know, but something is not happening somewhere. And it's only after I've worn it like this morning before coming to the church and I'm realizing I cannot breathe. <laughs> like as I'm sitting here, I cannot even overshake. But we move regardless. Um I don't have time to start changing. Oh, I think she's here. Oh I think she's here. Good morning. Good morning. Uh -huh. Why am I picking the answer? And the last motivation I want to reflect on 
is. At the areas, I tend to rely more on myself than God. If yes, how much God will be a full picture of yourself and present the entire burdens and load to Him so that in Him we may find full solace, joy, and happiness? Where do you find solace, dear brothers and sisters, when Christ? Inviting us to come to him with our burdens. We are speaking to Christ our Lord. So after Mass was over, I went outside to wear the cell prayer booklets to buy a particular novena booklet which my friend had asked me to buy and send to her. So as you can see here, these are different prayer booklets you can use and I was searching for a particular one which I saw. This is the particular booklet I was looking for. It is the novena to Mary who unties knots. If you know it, let me know in the comment section. So out here, the equally sells scapulas, prayer bands, in short, general Christian accessories, and equally have different rosaries, be it from precious blood to divine mercy, all the different prayer rosaries you can imagine, they have it here. Fam, I just have to show you guys the dress that stressed my life up. I felt like even my organs could not breathe inside this dress. I think it's a call for me to raid my closet, take out clothes and give out some clothes because what is this? Like what in heaven's name is this? Where? Yeah. Don't know. That's my sister. So you be just hang for that motor so you know if you shake that morning time, not tell me. <laughs> I just say thank you don't go. <laughs> Come on then, so far. <laughs> Hi! If we wait for day, hmm. you will change clothes. Mama me, eh, not say time you don't go. Um, I don't feel breathe fine, oh. That's the best you take and die, oh. This is the queen there. Okay, oh. You don't see that corset clothes there. Hi! That bright then they do not have it. You see me, the hang for back here, so. Ha! Hmm. We're not to make you on ties, not. Okay, not <laughs> you tired. won't find it. And you, you don't start it. Yes, you don't start it where you don't finish it. Yeah. You finish all the book, you pray it all. It has oh. each day. You are my God, creator of everything. You are my peace, you are my tranquility. From age to age, you are the everlasting king. Yeah. Ancient one, ancient one, you're never changing. We are going home. We are going home. We are going home. From church. How was church? How was church? <laughs> you all, so I'm about stepping out now. Wait, why am I even wearing bonnet on my head and I'm about stepping out? I don't know, please don't judge me. See, I was working, I was vlogging my day of today, and fam, somebody just came and gossiped to me that petrol has come, so I just took up and i want to go and put petrol in my mom's car now see my mom's car is almost entering reserve because there has been um petrol scarcity for some time now there's been petrol scarcity um they have banned um nigerian petrol which we usually use here we call it funge they have banned it from entering cameroon they used to smuggle it and enter but now it is like no it's no entry at all once they just see their boat carrying it they just shoot the boat the bomb it so petrol scarcity has been real in cameroon so it has put a lot of pressure for on the petrol stations and the petrol stations cannot deliver farm you go there only line before 12 noon petrol is finished at the petrol stations you see cars bikes packed why is this fly here but please let me send down this this glass for this fly to go this one fly making noise okay so that's what i was about saying that's what i was saying so petrol scarcity has been for a while now and fam i've been using this car <laughs> since my mom left i've not put petrol in it i think i put petrol once but 
since petrol scarcity i have not put petrol in it so yes i want to just run now somebody just came and gossiped to me that carol see petrol has come in so so and so petrol station just rush there now like this before the news wants to go wild and before you get there it's finished so yes fam that's where i'm hearing off to so i said i should update you guys and let me get going you know before i hear petrol sold out you did welcome me some kind of oh you did papa me some kind of oh you did papa me some kind of Oh, sorry. This is wrong. Yeah. Let me see. Please pray for me, pray for my country because this petrol scarcity is actually stressing us like <laughs> it is stressing us when I'm taking public transport farm in short transportation fare has increased like from here to Boya has now increased and even within town farm <laughs> I now pay 500 francs <laughs> 500 francs to get to where I'm going to unbelievable like <laughs> nah this is not for me this lifestyle can definitely not be for me but anyway so yeah that's it so yes update so i look funny no earrings nothing like i'm just from sleep anyway see you guys so after the petrol wahala i got into work to do one of the things i know how to do best and this is me taking out time to publicly appreciate all of you who have reached out to me to support me to patronize my business i am truly truly grateful i do not take it for granted i do not take your support for granted i do not take your trust for granted i am truly truly grateful i appreciate you so very much especially my subscribers those who are subscribed to me and have patronized me oh god you guys have a special place seated at the right hand of god the father in heaven <laughs> if you're watching this video and you haven't subscribed you're first of all already darling talk less or if you have not patronized me you're already darling please go to my business page it's on the screen and patronize me okay and after doing that i also did some donuts which i just had to show you guys as in look at this goodness look at these chocolates as in chocolate oozing out Chocolate lovers, gather here for a very, very brief meeting hosted by your president. <laughs> this is me just saying, please, whatever you want, come to us. We will deliver. We can deliver and we'll come through. Okay. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm definitely going to see you guys. Oh, la la. Look at that luciousness. I'm definitely going to see you guys on my next one. Finally, by the help of God. Bye.